We humans feel ourselves as the main species on the planet. We correct the terrain as we want and need to, cutting down forests, making residential areas and other structures. Besides, with building noisy and busy highways, large territories of animal habitats are divided into separate parts. But animals still keep on crossing them to get to their habitual range areas, water bodies and places of migration. Of course, many of them get under the wheels of cars. Fortunately, there are some people and even countries that do their best to help wild creatures to live a normal life in our concrete jungles. Let's see at the unbelievable tunnels, underpasses and other constructions that people have built for animals' comfort. Ten, Nutty Narrows Bridge This wonderful bridge for squirrels was first constructed in mid-60s in Longview, Washington. A builder, Amos Peters, who worked nearby the road, witnessed the squirrels being run over when crossing it. One day, he found out the squirrel with a nut in the mouth on the road and decided to change this terrible situation. He discussed this problem with the local businessman. And after getting the permission from the city council, the big work started. The structural engineering of the bridge was made by Donald Kramer. And Amos Peters and Bill Hutch built the 60-feet bridge from aluminum and lengths of fire hose. Some times later, people noticed that squirrels started using the bridge. The fluffy beauties were even seen escorting their young and teaching them how to use the ropes. In 1983, Peters took down the worn-out bridge for repairing. After changing some parts, he put the bridge to its place. Now in the region, there are several other bridges for squirrels that were constructed on this project. 9. Hume Highway Rope Bridge This rope bridge across the very busy four-lane Hume Freeway in Victoria State in Australia was constructed in 2007 for different representatives of a local fauna – possums, squirrel gliders, and cockatoos. Without this connection, some of these animals were cut off from food, shelter, or loving company. Besides, the young had trouble with finding new territories and populations were becoming smaller and genetically isolated. Squirrel gliders and possums use the rope bridge at night, while cockatoos, magpies, and many other birds occupy in daytime. The scientists found out that in 21 months period, different animals crossed this bridge more than 500 times. So, this construction is a very important thing, don't you think? 8. Ecolink at BKE And one more ecological bridge was built in Singapore. This unique construction is a safe passage for wildlife creatures over a busy highway. It was built to reconnect the Bukit Timah Nature Reserve and Central Catchment Nature Reserve to let animals living in both areas to safely cross the BKE Highway which separated the two forests when it was built in 1986. This bridge is used by civets, squirrels, and pangolins. There are a lot of cameras that watch if the animals go across the Eco Bridge. They have shown that the bridge is a safe path for birds and bats too. All in all, more than 15 species of mammals and birds have been spotted using this green corridor. The constructors hope that when the vegetation grow more, other animals like the elusive banded leaf monkey will also make use of the ecological bridge. 7. The Underpass for Elephants in Kenya Here in Africa, there is a great and increasing problem of human-animal conflict, and elephants suffer greatly from it. Human development separates elephant families and prevents them from getting together. But this tunnel is a real salvation to this problem. This construction in Nairobi connected two wild areas and two distinct elephant populations which were separated for years by humans. The underpass lets the animals cross the road without putting themselves or drivers in danger. It was a real surprise for constructors that elephants started using the underpass immediately. The first animal appeared in the tunnel the next day after the opening. Besides, this underpass helps people to protect their crops from hungry giants. The tunnel is situated in the hills below Mount Kenya with fields of wheat and canola. At last, elephants can go under the road without damaging crops or scaring people, lining in a nearby village. 6. K 
cattle underpass in Australia. Underpasses is the great thing, not only for wild and big elephants, but for not so big and not nearly wild cows. People living in Victoria State in Australia seem to be very concerned about the health and safety of the cattle, as the majority of them are the farmers and cattle holders. With the help of authorities of the state, different organizations construct cattle underpasses all over the territory of Victoria. So, since 2000, more than 500 underpasses were built, and as a result, thousands of cows were taken off the state's roads and saved their lives. 5. Banff National Park Overpasses and Underpasses Banff National Park is the wonderful place where people take good care about safe and comfortable animal traveling around the territory. They have built for wildfire a lot of crossing structures and highway fencing that have reduced large animal deaths by more than 80%. These structures play a very important role in the life of wild animals. As the scientific research showed, grizzly bears, moose, wolves prefer wide and open crossing structures. Cougars and black bears like underpasses more. About 150,000 uses of these structures have been recorded for the last 15 years. And this means a lot. Because for any animal living there, even trying to cross the highway can end tragically, but they don't. As a result, the populations are growing and animals can migrate to any part of the park they want. 4. Tiny Underpasses for Salamanders in Massachusetts in North Amherst in Massachusetts, there is one very unusual two-lane roadway. Just one rainy night each spring, this road becomes an invincible obstacle to hundreds of spotted salamanders that get out of their underground forest burrows on the east side of Henry Street to cross the road. The dark gray yellow spotted creatures need to get to the pools on the west side of Henry Street so they can mate. This journey had ended tragically for some of amphibians until in 1987 the special tunnel system for Henry Street salamanders was made. Since then, not only salamanders but frogs and other amphibians safely migrate back and forth through the tunnel. This structure is tiny and has a slotted top to provide enough of the dampness salamanders need to keep from drying out. 3. The Tunnel for Blue Penguins in New Zealand Oamaru Harbour, in the South Island of New Zealand, has been the home to a colony of blue penguins, the smallest ones in the world, since the early 1990s after they started nesting in a quarry. But they have the great obstacle between their nesting area, the ocean, the road with a very heavy traffic. Their dangerous path home every night took over 40 minutes. And of course, to see small dark blue creatures on the dark road was a very difficult task for drivers. To make little penguins daily way safe, the city of Oamaru with locals and scientists built an underpass in September 2016. As the scientists said, penguins began to use it almost immediately and now it takes them only 5 minutes to get to the place they need. Every night about 20 birds go through the tunnel. Two. The Tunnels for Turtles in Japan Every year from May to September, hundreds of reptiles make their way from Suma Aqua Life Park to the nearby ocean and then get back. But there are rail tracks on their way. When the turtles are trying to cross the tracks, some of them fall in. Unable to climb out, they start walking along the track. The problem is when a turtle is close to a railroad switch. Once the switch points begin to move, the little reptiles can suffer. Besides, there were costly train delays that happened every time a turtle got caught in the switch. To deal with this problem, the West Japan Railway Company with the Suma Aqua Life Park has done great work building turtle tunnels to prevent the small reptiles being harmed on tracks. The U-shaped concrete ditches have been built close to the treacherous switches. They give a place for the turtles to get into and protect them. 1. The Bridge for Crabs on the Christmas Island Every year, more than 50 millions of crabs make their way to the oceans to breed across the Christmas Island. After mating, the males go back inland, while the females spend two weeks at the beach, lay their eggs and then also head back to the forests. 
During this period, crabs are everywhere. Rangers from the Christmas Island National Park have built 31 underpasses on the island, with 13 miles of barriers to prevent crabs getting onto the roads. But in one place, it was impossible to make an underpass, so they built the bridge over the busy road instead. Now, this bridge is not only a helping tool for these animals, but a very popular thing among tourists. They come from all parts of the world to look how crabs go over the road on this bridge. We are sure that the more people take care about animals and providing the conditions for their living in our concrete jungles, the more humane and civilized they can be called. What do you think about it? Hope you find our video useful and interesting. See you!